Hey guys, um, I got a quick tutorial on how to install the emulator. Um, this is a guide that's already written out on the forums here. I just wanted to make a quick video for those who like video tutorials. Okay, so two quick things of note at the top here. Um, your login, your game login account is separate from your forum login account. So just keep that in mind when you're creating the uh, usernames and passwords. Um, they can, I think they can probably be the same, but anyway. Uh, also, if you have the original game discs, that version of the game doesn't, isn't what we're using. You can't use the, the discs. You have to use the sunsetted client, which is um, what we have here to download. So jumping right in, um, I'm going to start at two, step two, we're going to go to the downloads and we have a couple things here. Um, firstly, there's a link back to the setup guide. Um, we have the emulator launcher standalone and we have the actual game client. And right now they've added in the launcher into this file. So you don't, you don't need to download the launcher uh, anymore. You shouldn't need to anyway. Um, so, and this, this is all the same. This is just different like uh, compression types. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead with uh, 7-zip and I'm gonna let that download. Before we extract it or anything, you wanna go and click on it and open the properties and click the unblock uh, box here, apply that and hit OK. And now we can extract it. Um, and I recommend extracting it like it just in the hard drive by itself. Uh, don't put it in uh, like programs folder or anything because those are protected and it seems to cause issues with the game. So what I'm going to do is just extract right here. Like so. All right, so this is done. I'm gonna pop this open and your folder should look like this. It should have all the Vanguard bits and pieces um, and then It'll have the VGO launcher here. So we're going to go ahead and run this. And the first time you run it, it's going to try and detect the client. So it's going to, you're going to get some like pop-ups like this, and then it's going to shut down and generate all the files it needs to activate the launcher and connect to the server and all that. And then it'll, um, every time you start it up from here on out, it'll, it'll be normal and you just log in. So. This is the point at which we need a login account. Um, and I already have mine created, so I'm just gonna log in. And right now, there's only the one server, the new Talon, the alpha server where they're working on everything. Um, so you're free to join that whenever you like, whenever it's up. Um, You'll get a uh, end user license agreement, and and it'll open up in windowed mode, and uh, you can um, log into the game and mess with the settings from there, and you're good to go. One thing I want to note. Um, I'll, I'll log into a, a chunk here, uh, and depending on the chunk you are, some of them take longer to load, um, because some of them, the ones that are more, um, that, you know, there aren't a lot of people in, like it, it shuts down the chunk when nobody's in it for a while, so. If you're trying to load into one that's been empty for a while, it may take a little bit longer, but that's totally normal. Um, but yeah, so that's it. You're, you're good to go.
It's pretty quick and easy installation. And if you have any further questions or you want to hang out, we have a Discord channel um, that everyone hangs out in. And we'll be happy to answer questions and chat about Vanguard.